Welcome to this episode of 3B Outdoors. Today we're on the French Broad River. Barry Luke and I are going after big small mouth and big large mouth. We have a plan. And as you know how plans are, they very seldom work out as expected. Today was no different. We had to zig and zag a little bit, a few surprises along the way. What you're going to see today is a totally unexpected. This episode is entitled, The Cameraman Rocks. Thanks for watching 3B Outdoors. I'm Nathan Light. Sit back and enjoy. He is a good one, 3B Outdoors, boys. Oh, whoa. Big bass, bird. Yes! 12 pound even, biggest fish I ever caught out there. He beat two brothers in the woods and hit a double right off the bat. Very proud hunter right here. Yes, sir. It all happened so fast. Boom! That just happened. You won't catch anything like this out on the water. That's the best one. 3B Outdoors is brought to you by Visit Kingsport, Tennessee. We're going to East Tennessee, Sevierville, French Broad. Let's see what we can catch. I'd say largemouth and smallies. We've been here before, right? Yes, we did, Nathan. We did well, didn't we? We is not part of the option on that day. Fish hatchery road. Yeah, yeah, baby, that's where we're going, fish hatchery. Hey, we're going, we hope fish to hatch, hatch some out only there. I hope they've been hatched out for a while. Yeah, like I couldn't catch years. one in a hatchery. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you now, last time, you know, Barry was kind of talking about, you know, we were down here. It's been a few years now, but man, we had an awesome trip. I mean, you know, we talk about all the friendly competition and everything we talk about, and it's all good, but man, when somebody's catching fish on 3B Outdoors, we don't really care who it is, but man, it is a fish producing place down here. We got potential for some big fish, got potential for a lot of fish. So. I've never seen this many people down here before. That's what I was afraid of on Saturday, I guess. I'm afraid to be packed. Here we are at the mighty French Broad River. Uh, the road that you can hear running over our head leads right in downtown Sevierville, right near the Smoky Mountain National Park. Just a little drive from my hometown of Kingsport, Tennessee, and our premier sponsor. So this is a popular destination for tourists, but today we're not tourists. We're fishing. We're going to try to catch some big old green fish, maybe some smallmouth. Big smallies too, we hope. We hope. No, last, time, last time we were here, you put on an epic day. I mean, you had a great day. I had a good day watching, but man, <laughs> when, when they're coming over the side of the boat, we don't really care who's catching them. As long as we catch them, right? As long as we catch them. So what do you think will be the tail of the tape today, Barry? The tail of the tape today will be, be tough, but the bites you'll get will be big. It's March, March Madness. It's smiley time. The forsythia bushes are bloomed out. The Bradford pears are already bloomed and leafing. It is time, my friend. It is time. It's about 30 <laughs> some degrees. You can see our breath in the blowing in the breeze. So we're going to get her done. We're going to launch this big jet boat and go after them. I'm Nathan Light. I'm Barry Luke. 3B Outdoors coming at you, man. Dog, here we come. Careful, our old man. Oh man, <laughs> Mark Madness, baby. There's your keys in case I go down. You'll still be able to drive home. Well, I won't go home if you don't go home. Is when that river's up like this, it, put, it makes a water dam right here. And it dams it before the current's coming down this way, and it just, the where it goes across down here, and it just stops it, so it kind of backs it up a little bit. Sorry, baby. All right. We're on the board. What is that? That's a walleye. Sauger? It ain't a bass. Sauger. Sauger. Oh, well, they gotta be 15 inches? I think, yeah. Old Sauger. If he was a little longer, the next time he would swim would be in the frying pan grease. 
Got the stink off. Got a bite. Back out. Come off. Come off? Ooh. You talking about drilling me. And I ain't even joking. And it just came off. They're they're tricky today. Slow. Thank bait. Yeah. Old cranker. Hey, he drilled it, but why he came off I do not know. This portion of 3B Outdoors is brought to you by these fine companies. Here in Northeast Tennessee, the mountains have a story to tell. An exciting account of outdoor adventure, full of fishermen's tales from our finest rivers and lakes. A genuine page turner, brimming with places to retreat, play, relax, sure to leave you wanting more. Come and write your own chapter in this mountain tale. Hey, Freddie, I believe that's about 30 yards. Daggone it, Chris. I had it. Hey, Nathan. Hey. You should keep your mouth on it. Good night, Chris. I got it. I'm Chris Dedrick with Mill Creek Construction, proud sponsor of 3B Outdoors. Now I love coaching Freddie and Nathan. I'm also a donor of the Kingsport Miracle Fields, and this is my friends Judd and Nick T. And we hope you support also. Have you been injured due to someone else's negligence? Do you know your time to file a claim is limited by law? For a free injury case evaluation, call 423-896-1974. Jim Williams and Associates, Attorneys at Law. Whether you're spending the day running around at 70 miles an hour in a high-powered bass boat, fishing a competitive stress field tournament, or just enjoying a day on the lake, you can never have enough, Dr. Enough. Check us out on the internet at 3boutdoors.com, plus YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Yeah, got him baby. A, I got him a small game. It's a good. Yep. That's a good. The whacker good, bud. You get it pretty, pretty solid. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Stay in. He'll stay. Old D, getting her done, old D. Get it in the boat. Get it. You, in the boat. You get him. Nope. Did you get him? I don't like missing him. There we go. Oh, yeah. Good job, D. You got to say it, though. Well, it started out as cameraman. Cameraman rocks. Good little smallmouth. Pretty. Well. Good job, D, buddy. Maybe they'll get fired up here in a minute. I mean... We went up this whole stretch for, what, a mile up through there? Yeah. And come back down. They've been slow. Hit these rocks over on this side, drops off, and that's where it was. Good job, D. That a boy, D. You got to say the cameraman rock. Cameraman rock, baby. Go back there. <laughs> Look there. Good job, that's brother. It right there. A little DT6. Mm -hmm. A little demon action going on. Get him for you. Just don't he's even horse him. No, don't horse him. He'll be <laughs> all right. Don't horse him. That's a big one. Don't horse him. Well, he'll just let him, just let him do his thing. Told him. There, there you go. I'll get him for you. He's a good one. What got to do? He tagged it, didn't he, D? He's going to start to it. 
take your time. Oh, he swallowed it. He swallowed it. Hold on. He's got it in there good. He ain't going to whore. That's a four pounder, I'd say. Doing good. <laughs> oh, what do you think, Oh, baby. Oh, get him. Get him. <laughs> he got off, though. Oh, that a boy. Woo! Huh? Is that your biggest one ever? That's Look at that. the biggest one I've ever caught. Smile now. Good night. Look at that. What a bass. That's a huh? That's right there, right? That's <laughs> you got you. Look here. I'll let you get him. But they, they... Holy huh? <laughs> That's 21 inch or plus. Easy. <laughs> oh, your camera. Say it. Tell Janet in that camera right there what the cameraman does. There's one thing about it, the cameraman rocks today, especially. That yeah, right there is awesome, man. <laughs> Nathan said, I got a carp. <laughs> Congratulations, brother. Biggest one ever? I believe that's pretty close to the biggest one I've ever caught. That's not beautiful. That Look one. at the bars on that thing. We floated on down through here a little bit more. <laughs> Congratulations, swim, buddy. I mean, it tackled it. Congratulations, D. Attaboy, D. That's a good one right there. Good thing he is taking her back to the water. Congratulations, Attaboy, brother. D. Oh, yeah. Huh? <sighs> you, you tell me. <sighs> Tater. You tell me what old D did. That's what I'm talking about. Tater, baby. Hey. D, 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 man. We smoked her on that one now. There you pink house cow. up there. Look up there. Like, look at him. That's what you call it. The pink house. Pink house. That'll be the pink house bass forever. Pink house smallmouth right there. Right? Takes a real man to fish in front of a pink house. Look <laughs> here, big man. I love you, buddy. Love. Cinco bass. Finally, it's one hit, though. I'm telling you. Been a rough day, ain't it? Talk about a slow day. Well, Coach been putting it Coach's on. Coach been putting it on, but I snuck one in the back door. Though. We might be on the track here now. Get late in the day. Catch tighter. Broke ice. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Yeah, baby. Perfectly wild thing crank bait. Eh? Good. Old green fish. He come to play. Easy now. Oh, oh yeah. Old green fish. He's hefty. Yep. Big old, big old fat belly. Running in the trees, ain't we? Berkeley wild thing crankbait. Square bill acts, but real erratic and a slow rise. They love it. Yes, sir. Thank you, Lord. Got a little belly on him, don't Yeah, a little belly. That yeah, boy, boy. Could be the late evening time. We struggled around. Boy, I'm telling you, I'm awesome. There you go. <laughs> this portion of 3B Outdoors is brought to you by these fine companies. In Northeast Tennessee, you live the mountains, live the music, live the sizzle of local flavor, live the heart of its people, live the adventure at every turn while you retreat. When you visit Kingsport, you live Kingsport. Sleek new design with easy control file. The clearest images underwater with uncompromising range. Live mapping from the touchscreen. View notifications, video, even Google Maps on screen. And for the first time ever, Real-time view of fish movements with live sight sonar. HDS Live, new from Lowrance. 
3B Outdoors is stoked to announce a new partnership with Dwayne Wilson, owner of Dixie Custom Rods and Tackle. He builds truly custom rods at an affordable price for any style and action up to the 9 foot 9 inch ledge rocket. For an amazing combination, add one of his new reels to a custom rod. Dwayne's tungsten jigs and weights, the Mega Flash and Dixie Triple Threat umbrella style rigs are proven fish catching machines. Dwayne might even build you one just like the one I use, a 7 foot 4 inch medium action tight lining rod that is totally out of this world. Luminox are brighter, more durable, and with replaceable batteries, the longest lasting compound and crossbow lighted knocks on the market, period. When your moment of truth comes, rely on the only lighted knock trusted by the best. Luminox. Light them up at Luminox.com. What are we doing in here? <laughs> it's a jungle. I'm trying to help my brother coach out there. He didn't want to lose that spinner bait. Good man. That's war eagle. <laughs> What's going on, Coach? Yeah, kind of had a mess out there. Some, uh, some reeds there, they just don't like it. So, what am I? You're welcome. That is all. For that right there, wasn't it? All right, right there. Just for that one little spare bait. Good. Oh yeah, that's a tough. Get him naked. Yes. Finally. That afternoon bite, maybe. <laughs> Jig bite, finally, boy. That's a pretty thing. Look at that big old wide tail. I mean, he hit it like he's supposed to, didn't he? He hit it the way he's supposed to, man. That's a good one. Yes, sir. Man, they're barred up today, pretty, aren't they? Yeah, that's a pretty fish right there. I like Beautiful. It. I like it. Beautiful. Yeah, baby. That's like I said right here at this end. I think it's where they come out of the main, main river and come up in this little corner. He's party should have been, ain't he? Yep. Finally stuck on a oh, jig. Knew I told you. What did I tell you? Stay with him, good and they good and good. Stay with him, stay with him. That's a good one. Oh, I know it's a good one. I don't know what it is, but that's no, a good one. No, it's a big bass. Stay with him. Oh, that's a monster. That's a monster. I'll get him. I think I'm gonna mess this one for him, Nathan. It's a monster. That's a monster. I think. Uh, it's not as big as the other one, I don't think. This yeah, is but it. I thought he was. Gosh, I thought he was when he first <laughs> came up there. Get on that spinnerbait. Yeah. Oh, come boy. up this way. Well, I told you, you'd be thanking me later about the spinnerbait bite. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that bigger than that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> What'd I tell you? Throw in that stained water and bust him, baby. Huh? That boy, Coach. <laughs> What'd I tell you? Me right there, boom, boom, boy. baby. Huh? I told I'm you. Doing it. Told you. Yeah, dude. Yeah, I believe that one's bigger than that other one. Took care. Ain't as long. I mean, barely come out. What a man. That boy coats. That boy coats him. Yeah, I believe that nurse. Yeah, that one's definitely got more weight to it and bigger. Boy, it's pretty. It don't get any better than that right there. Hey, and you know another thing? You won't catch anything like this in the woods. Right? You won't catch anything like that in the woods. That old boy. Back in the I guess he told you. Yeah, I baby. I guess he told you, didn't you? Tater. I'm uh, telling you, that's. Uh, was that, hey, they don't fight nothing like your smallmouth out there. I'm telling you. Did you say ex hunting pro staffer? <laughs> Is that what I'm hearing? Well, uh, you know, I mean, it's one of them things. But you're right, you don't catch nothing like that yeah, in the woods. Yeah, I mean, yeah. All right. No, Good deal. No, you don't, you don't get to fight in the woods. Coach. What's up, Coach? Keep catching, baby. He's going to work back here, man. Oh. Feel good? Okay. Holy cow. Look at that thing. You talking about a toad? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, holy. Hold on just a second, we get to that. Holy cow. Keep doing that, brother. 
Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Keep yeah, your right tip up. Keep your right tip up a little bit. Hey, you're a foot bigger than the other one. Yeah, oh. baby. Now, there's your That's biggest one, one ever. I'm about right there. <laughs> now, there's your biggest one. That's a toad. Huh? Is that you? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> you, that is a toad up there now. You're walking on them today, ain't you, Coach? I love it. Hey, it's uh, <laughs> the good Lord's oh, blessing yeah, you, buddy. Exactly. Yeah, uh, it's a good Lord blessed day. That's best all smile my say. day ever. Yeah, isn't it? there you go. Let's take your picture. Good job, is, our uh, brother. Smile mouth I've ever felt. You said that three times yeah. today, Coach. Yeah, keep going. <laughs> you said that. Hey, keep going. Yeah, he said it three times but today. Let me just tell you one thing. He ain't over yet. It's been a beautiful day. Been with some great friends. And the good Lord has blessed us big time today. Good job, dude. That's about all we can say. Get her back in there. Come on, girl. You ready to go? This portion of 3B Outdoors is brought to you by these fine companies. Have you been charged with a crime? Do you know your constitutional rights? For a free criminal defense consultation with an experienced Tennessee, Virginia criminal defense attorney, call 423-217-4685. Jim Williams and Associates, Attorneys at Law. Well, this turkey hunting is way overrated. Let's go down to Kearney's and get us some of that roasted chicken. You know what Mike says, seven days about chicken makes one week. Let's go. On a good home cooked meal, come to Lynn Garden Restaurant in Kingsport. You won't be disappointed. And here's your proof. Gone it, Chris. I had it. Hey, hey. You can keep your thumb on it. Good night, Chris. I got it. I'm Chris Dedrick with Mill Creek Construction, proud sponsor of 3B Outdoors. Now I love coaching Freddie and Nathan. I'm also a donor of the Kingsport Miracle Fields, and this is my friends Judd and Nick T. And we hope you support also. Here in Northeast Tennessee, the mountains have a story to tell. An exciting account of outdoor adventure, full of fishermen's tales from our finest rivers and lakes. A genuine page turner, brimming with places to retreat, play, relax, sure to leave you wanting more. Come and write your own chapter in this mountain tale. Check us out on the internet at 3boutdoors.com, plus YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Tell me if you need a net. I haven't seen him yet. I haven't seen him. I don't know what he is. He's a Clydezilla. He's a bass. He's a bass. I'm talking about a power. You usually don't use a net. Oh, my goodness. He's bird, he's bird, he's bird, he's bird. Oh. Oh. <laughs> don't you tell me we don't need a net today. You have to in this situation. <laughs> yeah, baby. Yeah, yeah, that's a five pounder. <laughs> Ten after seven. Ten after seven. We've wow. been fishing since eight o'clock this morning. Ten after seven. And we're still after it. <laughs> we got a little old bitty hook out there. Look at wow. Little Cinco, little bitty hook. Bam, baby. Great old big toad right there, son. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> that's a five. <laughs> yeah, look at that thing. Yeah, baby. Ooh -wee. Look, he's got he's a tail like a. Look at I know. Ball. That's the reason you do catch and release right there. See that little hook in his jaw right there? He's been caught before. And we're going to turn him loose here in a minute. Let somebody else get Baby, baby, look at that. Baby. Ooh. Son, you never talking. give up, like an alley. I'm telling you, we we have grounded out all day. Almost 12 hours. Oh, look at that thing in the water there. You talking about a pretty fish? Oh yeah. 
All right. Got to have some tater. Three bit outdoors taters. I'm telling you, man. Yeah. Stomped it. Baby doll. I like it. I put my new fish monkey gloves to test. I told you, coach, it's in fish monkey it gloves. Well, it's been a super day. We had the privilege today of having a cameraman, which is very odd for us. Me and Nathan's usually doing it. But uh, Big D, Dustin Coates, got to come today. And we couldn't catch him. <laughs> so the cameraman rocks. <laughs> That's all you can say. <laughs> he started catching them, and he's had the time of his life. Biggest small mouth ever. Three well, times. Three times, <laughs> yeah. He's got another one. He's got another one. Big and big and big and. <laughs> Are you kidding me? While we were talking. I told you, I told, I told you. you. It's his day, boys, it's his day. It's your day. Yeah. Are you going to need the net? Are you going to need the net? No, it's it. I don't know what you're doing. As I said. You're whining like a little girl. Go ahead and get him in there. As I said, there's nothing else to say. When the man has got the lucky horse you, look here. Good Ricky. job, D. Amen. <laughs> Enough said, my friends. Enough, it, baby. Enough said. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you can't do no more than that. That's live, baby. Uh, that's that's live. live action. Now, where was you at with your story? <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Good job, dude. Here you go, Nader, man. He's, he's said right. enough. He's Amen. Wearing, he's wearing it out, boys. I mean, the, one of the best days ever. I'm Good telling you. Good job, dude. One of the well, best I'm days ever. Right there. One of the Get best the days there. ever. <laughs> it can't get oh, no better than that. No. no it coach. can't. There ain't no way. It can't, it, it, I mean, what can't, it can't get no better than that. Oh, no. I mean, we're still rolling on the same thing. <laughs> you can't get no better than that. We can't even do a close for him, man. Yeah. He keeps catching them. You want to try to do that again or just like no, that? No, as I said. I mean, just call it good. Call it good. All Amen. Right. We're gonna see if you can get you a big one. <laughs> no, I ain't going to. I don't need one now, How man. Can you top of that? That's awesome. Right here, right here. Come on. Talk Come on. about it. One, one, one more go around. One more go around. Come on. That's killer. I mean, you can't, you can't make that <laughs> you stuff up. You can't make that stuff up. You can't make it up. Well, that was an exciting trip, not only for me and Barry, but for Big D Coates. Every time he'd catch one of those big bass, what would he say? This is the biggest one ever. No, the next one, this is the biggest one ever. I don't know how many times he said that, but man, we made a memorable trip that all of us will remember for a long time. Don't miss next week's episode with Freddie Neely. They'll have an exciting hunting trip going on somewhere, as I promise you. I'm Nathan Light. Thanks for watching 3B Outdoors. In the morning before the rising sun, load up the boats, rods and reels. I think it's going out there from Cotton Small Man. There's. Yeah, that was different. Got more weight to it and bigger. Small mouth I've ever had. You said that three times today. <laughs> <laughs> you said that. You're going to catch anything like this in the woods, right?